Okay, and now here's a theorem which I, I'm going to essentially prove for you, if not today, then uh, certainly by the first bit of uh, our lecture on Thursday. And, and this is going to make complete sense to you. The set of all solutions to a homogeneous linear recurrence equation of the form that we've just written down. Oh, I see. I, there's a, this, this equation is badly written. See that a to the n plus d? It's just supposed to be a to the d. I told you I was editing these slides just before I came here, and I screwed this one up. This, this should be, look at the equation on the preceding slide. Now, see at the, at the bottom of the slide? C0, A to the D, et cetera. Okay, so this equation is supposed to be the same. The, Okay, but the solution to this is a d-dimensional vector space. If you give me a polynomial of degree d in the advancement operator, I get a d-dimensional vector space. The whole Bloomin thing is infinite dimensional, but when I take the solution space, voila, it collapses down to a d-dimensional finite dimensional vector space. And just like you did in calculus, when you're working with a finite dimensional vector space, the way you do things is you determine a basis. You find d linearly independent vectors, and then all vectors are just simply linear combinations of your basis vector. So ultimately, what we're going to do is look at an equation of the correct, written in the correct form, and we're going to find a basis for the solution space. Okay, so now let's think about why, why is the solution space a space? If you have two solutions, let me back up. It, look at the equation on the bottom. If you have two solutions, f and g, what about the sum f plus g? It's a solution. If you have a solution f and you multiply it by a scalar, alpha, the alpha just factors out. And so alpha times zero is zero. So you have a vector space a subspace, and of course the zero function is a solution. If you put the zero function right there for f of n, then you get zero. So that's why the solution space is really a space. 